terms of a transition is some three years ago now. Here we are in 2020. Susan Rice is being talked about as a potential VP, VP nominee right. uh, for Joe Biden. Your thoughts not just on that, but big picture here. What kind of accountability then are you calling for? It's one thing to have hearings on Capitol Hill, as Lindsey Graham wants to. But John Durham is doing this investigation, a lot of speculation. Chuck Grassley and others have said something may be coming in the next few weeks. What are you expecting? You've seen the long short list of Joe Biden's VP choices. They all happen to be female. He sounds like a, you know, a co-ed at the end of a frat party. I need a woman. Uh, so now he has binders of women he's looking through. And he's got people like Sally Yates and Susan Rice allegedly on this list. And those are two women who were very involved in this, in the shenanigans that were happening in the days before we got here to the, to the Trump White House. Uh, she can't be trusted. And she's proved that. And I think the very easy question she would be asked in a debate against Vice President Mike, uh, Mike Pence, which he clearly would win, uh, is, well, what did you know? When did you know? Why are you writing emails to yourself? Why are you saying one thing on TV? Do you realize she was asked by a network anchor on a, on a show, quote, can you rule out that President Trump is a Russian asset? And she basically shrugged her shoulders. She couldn't rule out that the current president of the United States is a Russian asset. So she lacks credibility. Um, and you know what, Ed, I got to push back on the fact that because this was three plus years ago, it doesn't matter. Excuse me. I didn't me. say it didn't matter. We put, Let's be no, clear. no, not you. Not okay. you. They're saying this. They, the, okay. the people who would be held accountable are saying this. Oh, move on. We have a global pandemic. Excuse me. This president is team, the task force, the vice president, been working day and night for, for over two, three months now on the global pandemic. We can also have the proper authorities go back and see who knew what, because this country was dragged through the Russia collusion, delusion, illusion, nonsense, Mueller investigation, okay. Mueller hearings, so Mueller report, Mueller testimony for over two years, and we paid for it. We have a right to get that to its logical conclusion, which means look at the other side of the coin here. Kellyanne, moving on to the crisis at 